channel XOXO Sheba. Today's video is a wig review and this wig is an afro kinky hair. Um, it's from one of the Amazon brands. It is the, I want to say Aussie hair. Like it's A-I-S-I -S -I, so I'm, go I'm rolling with Aussie hair. <laughs> but yeah, it's a synthetic afro wig so I mean not like an Amara La Negra afro rig but more like a um just like a really curly wig that she probably got bangs and stuff with we just go we just gonna take it out the package and see what we doing okay okay so it's got decent packaging it didn't come in like a hard case at all it literally comes like this in the like the box that it came in oh how nice they give you a wig cap you guys they just I like that, okay? Cause I surely didn't have a wig cap and I did not want y'all to see these braids. They are trash, okay? Okay, so far it's got a dye smell to it, that's for sure, but I think a little powder or a little spray or something can get rid of that. The curls definitely look a little manufactured to me, so you are gonna have to play with it a little bit. Well, we gonna have to play with it a little bit. We gonna have to see what we working with, see what we can, if we can turn this Rick James into Rakisha. It's a full cap wig, like there's no parting space whatsoever. If you're not gonna wear this as a curly bangs in your face and stuff like that, this is not for you. There is no parting going on in this unit at all. And I think the top's a little weird. I don't know if this comes off on camera, but like the way the curls are sitting, like it needs more fluff at the top. I don't know, I guess I should put it on first before I say all that. But I think it's just weird looking at the very top. This wig cap even smells like dye. This is a lot. Oh, and by the way, we do have adjustable straps going on in here. And it does have combs in the front, but I don't see where or why you need it. Whew. All right, so let's see what we can do with this thing. Where's my scissors? Let me not do like I did that one time with that wig transformation fail and cut them too high though. That was bad. That was all bad. I'm making random cuts by the way. I don't know what I'm doing. Them curls is way too long. You need to cut it. doctor it up to frame your face and just kind of make it look you know how you want it to look it's really like real abstract you can do a lot with it and by a lot I just mean how you cut and shape it because you ain't gonna part it nowhere or pull it up or nothing like that uh, -uh. one look as far as shedding and tangling goes I mean it sits above your neck if you cut it to shape and all that so you're not gonna really have too much problems with tangling outside of it just being a spiral curl tight curled synthetic wig like it's gonna tangle a little bit um what else but on the shedding uh, I haven't experienced any shedding so far outside of me just cutting the wig I've not experienced any um, unsolicited shedding let's say that overall I think this is a really cute wig this is a really cute starter wig too if you're just getting into wigs and stuff like that or if maybe you're someone who wears their hair typically in a natural curly state if you want to Get something that mimics that look, but you want to, you know, protect your hair, stuff like that. This is a good look for this. And it was only $20. I mean, this is really good for $20. I've paid $40 for wigs like this before. And it's just about the same quality, so what's the tea? If you would like to purchase this wig, I will link it down below in the description box for you. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.